Agribusiness is taking over, poisoning, bankrupting and enslaving. The hogs dump their feces and urine on the floor. It goes under the hog house out to a lagoon. They slop it on the fields. It runs off into the ditches and it goes right down to our streams, creeks and rivers. Basically untreated waste. When it's spraying, you just cut your breath off. And you get like phlegm in your throat. You, your eyes start running, you know, and you just get a headache. What we have is the application of industrial systems that were designed to build cars and build machines to living creatures. Ja chcę czyste powietrze, żeby nie śmierdziało, żeby moja wnusia żyła w czystym powietrzu, zdrowo, tak, żeby mogła żyć naprawdę zgodnie z przyrodą i żeby nie było korupcji, wszystkiego, tylko nie korupcji. Every one of these facilities puts out one billion antibiotic resistant bacteria every day that crosses the property line and threatens the health of people who live downwind of those facilities. We've got a system here which is actually causing the pigs to be carrying dangerous infections which are going to come home and haunt us. And meat which may appear very cheap could be at the cost of our own lives. Pur și simplu, problema e că s-a cam distrus creșterea porcului la noi în comună. Ce mănâncă? Nu e aici, uite, ia până la pișaleu, nu mănâncă, băga mașul cu la înmăsază. Și-a aruncat acolo pișaleu, la noi, în spate. Deci fix, cum e casa mea, în spate. E bega și în spate, acolo arunca pișaleu. Deci și o s-a aruncat și porci morți acolo, în bega. Miroasă, nu poți să stai. Altă dată poate nu, dar mereu miroase și curge ochii, curge nasul, curge... Concret, porci bolnavi da, oameni bolnavi da, apă uzată da, apă poluată da. Dezastru în România! Da! Dezastru! This is the Walmartization and commoditization of every product. The whole mission of the European Bank has been to industrialize Central and Eastern European agriculture pushing out small farmers, opening it up to takeover by foreign corporations. They are homogenizing and they're diminishing quality of life. We need a revolution now, the fight against the corporate feudalism that it is embodied so much by this industry that is eroding everything and subverting everything that we care about in our democracy. The consumer ultimately has the power. They can say whether they buy cheap pork, that they don't care where it's produced or how it's produced or the quality of it. Ultimately, if the consumer refuses to buy that and prefers to buy meat which has a high welfare standard produced in an environmentally sensitive way, then we'll be on to a winner, you know.